Go ahead. What's up, guys? We're going to get our core workout in here. This is exactly what happens when you procrastinate and put all your workouts off for the day. Now you have to do four in a day. I'm speaking only from my own experience here. But to you, this might be your only workout of the day. So we're going to go core. We're going to go hard. We're going to go plank first or a rolling plank. So I'm going to get ready here. Four seconds. We're going to get started. Three, two, one. You can just hold the plank or you can go to a rolling plank. So I'm going to roll out and I'm going to turn out to one side and turn out to the other side. So I'm just turning. Extend the arm up. Stretch the back out. The core stays tight. We're always holding with the core. It is a core workout. So that's going to be a little bit of a theme here. Good. Let's rotate with control side to side here. Two, one, stop. Nice. Next one. We'll do reverse crunch or you can do infinity figure eight abs. So reverse crunch. We're going to be on the back here. In and out with the legs. When your knees come in, they rock in a little bit. If you want to do infinity abs, it's a figure eight or an infinity symbol with the legs right here. So I'm coming always to the middle right here, out to the side, up, and back through. Notice that figure eight or infinity symbol that I'm creating with my legs. As the core remains tight, I'm keeping my head off of the ground too to get the upper abs engaged a little bit more. Good. Nice. We'll go to the next one. On the feet for this one, we got knee strikes. Knee strikes, you can go five per side and add a burpee option. So I'm going to start with the hands up, give myself a target. Two, three, four, five. Go down, burpee, come up. Going on the other side when I come up. Five, down, burpee, up. So you guys got the option. You can do your modified burpee, where it's just down and up, or you can get that chest to the ground every time, what we call a competition burpee, down all the way, come back up. One burpee left, good. Moving right through, heels to the heaven, or you can do crunches, either one. Right here, regular crunches, we'll be up and down, starting again here, or we can go heels to the heaven, legs go straight up, and we're gonna keep them straight up, and just the hips are going upward, heels to the sky, or to the heavens, up with those feet. Strong core, strong core. We want to keep those legs in one straight line. I don't want these feet over the head or too far this way. Keep going straight to the top, all in one line. That's another rest mark, good. Squat thrust, stepping or hopping. Hands go on the ground, start from plank position. You can step in and out, I'm gonna be hopping. Notice he's keeping his shoulders over his wrist. He's not pushing back. He's not letting his hips come up. He's going back to a plank position every time. Feet are slipping in the back a little bit on this press. <laughs> but he's hopping all the way we back. Can fight the elements though. We got a little bit of rain. Yes. Nothing stops us. Nothing stops us. Starting those five moves over again. Plank or rolling plank for everybody. Getting in position. We'll start in three, two, one. Roll out to the side. Now to the other side. I like to extend the arm up. Helps me get a fuller stretch through the back. Helps me remind me to open up fully on each side. Meanwhile, core is still engaged. But I'm still breathing. He's still breathing. I'm still having fun. It's all good. He's alive. You're alive, gonna breathe. Make it through this, we're gonna do it together. We got another 10 seconds to gather ourselves up. Reverse crunch, or the figure eights, the infinity, whatever you like to call them, get them moving. Second time through, we're working hard this time. We know what we're doing. He's making that infinity sign. Try to get more range of motion this time with the legs further out to the side, more oblique work. Big loops, big loops. There you go. Nice and tight all the way through. Where's that time rat? There it comes. That's a stop. That one's fun. <laughs> Knee strikes next. 
We're almost there. We got a little ways to go. A little Sorry. bit. Five, three, four, five, burpee. Down, knee strike. Three, four, five, down. Bring it to the other side. Bring it to the other side. Have some fun with your workout today. Workout, workout today. <laughs> edit that out right <laughs> yeah probably <laughs> but why would you want to we're having fun we're in hotel rooms I think workouts make you crazy I don't know it's possible well yeah look at us <laughs> heels to heavens or crunches your option again crunches easier heels to heavens a little more control here Good guys, I like to exhale as the heels go up. Again, straight line. Don't let those legs waver too much. Feet don't come over the face. They go to the heavens all the way up because we might need some divine intervention to get through this workout. So we reach to the heavens. Up. He's going high with his hips, but if you can right, only guys. go an inch off the ground, that's fine too. Squat thrust, squat thrust. In and out with the legs. Tight core, tight core. Try to get the feet all the way up towards those hands. Bring the knees all the way in. That's where the core is. Your core is pulling the knees up. Got to catch it on the way back. It's basically an extension and a crunch with the abs right there. Good, into our bonus round here. New moves for five moves. Good, we're gonna go slow-mo reverse crunches here. So this is gonna take some control. Legs are gonna go away, but I'm going nice and control. Bring it back in, and as I bring it back in, I rock those hips up, but I do it with the core. The core is doing the work here, so as I pull it in, good. You really start to feel it. It looks like it would be easier, but it is not easier, <laughs> as you might be able to tell from my voice. Good. So I pull in and I squeeze. I squeeze that core to bring them in. I'm not using momentum to rock the hips back. So just getting those hips an inch off the ground makes that work a little bit more. We're going to come back to that move, so remember that. All right. High plank. So high plank position. Here's option one. Just hold this. Hold this with one leg up and we'll come back and get it on the other side. Otherwise, you're going to go up to downward dog. Downward dog, knee through. Downward dog, knee through. Good, pull that knee all the way through. He pushes back with his shoulders and he crunches through with the abs. Chest back towards that leg. You can help it. This other leg never touches the ground here. Nice. All right, right back to slow-mo reverse crunch. There's a little bit of a pattern here at the end. Extend, slowly crunch them in. Good, out of way. Slowly pull them in. Nice, nice, nice. Oh yeah. Gotta squeeze, gotta extend, hold that out for a second. It's all control, all about control here. It's getting hard to talk. Yeah, why don't you say some stuff? Okay. <laughs> Welcome to the Derek Show. Uh, downward dog again. Going downward dog. Good. We're going opposite side this time. So I came through with the right knee before. This time, I'm going to bring the left knee all the way underneath. Get my knee strikes. Crunch the knee in with your core. Push back with your shoulders. Get that good stretch. So you're getting a stretch. You're getting a crunch. You're kicking see. back, a little bit of everything. You're getting the back of your legs, you're getting your core, you're getting your shoulders, getting cardio, getting in shape. Drive it, nice, nice, last knee strike there. Good, one more slow-mo reverse crunch and we'll be set for the day. So we've all mastered this by now, use good form. Out, squeeze it back in, out. You got 20 seconds just working hard. Good. He's pulling so in. You can continue with this. I'm going to hold the legs out for the last 15 seconds and just hold them off the ground there. 
Okay, hold that strong. Then I'm gonna get the hands over the head with a little grass in my mouth. Nice, nice. Core tight, core tight. Hold what you got. I'll throw in a V up just for good measure and die. All right, kids, core workout. It's all done. Thanks for joining us. Enjoy your travel workouts.